Are you ready to upgrade to CA Privileged Access Manager 3.2 or do you still have questions about what's new? In the next three minutes, I'll give you a quick update of the most important changes for this release. Virtual machine support from Microsoft Azure, Microsoft Azure as an IDP, and more enhancements. Let's start with support for Microsoft Azure. CA Privileged Access Manager is now available in a VHD image. At this release, you can deploy a virtual appliance in Microsoft Azure, deploy a management console on Microsoft Azure, use Microsoft Azure CIFS storage for session recording and database backup, and import Microsoft Azure virtual machines. Also, PAM now uses Microsoft Azure as an identity provider. Regardless of whether your CA Privileged Access Manager instance is deployed in Microsoft Azure, you configure PAM to use Active Directory on Microsoft Azure as its identity provider using SAML. This release also provides two new features related to logging. First, we have added fields to the logs for target account and password view request ID. So when you run an external database query, you can connect the audit log and the request log for a complete audit trail of end user activity. Also, you can now capture user interface activity in a log. And this may be useful when troubleshooting problems with CA support. For the remote CLI, this release includes two updates. You can now activate and manage the CA PAM Windows Proxy from the remote CLI. The new command is update agent because the Windows Proxy is a type of agent. And for reporting purposes, you can now filter password view requests based on the start and end time of the request. We now offer mobile device support for viewing passwords and checking out and in of accounts. We support Chrome on Samsung Galaxy 7 and 8 phones and Safari on iPhone 8 and 10 and iPad Pro 10.5 and 12.9. And for Service Desk, we now support newer versions such as BMC Remedy 9.1 and we've added the option to download logs. And finally, the external API includes new policy audit operations for the device and user resources. Also, the CAPAM RDP client supports forward secrecy using newer cryptographic methods. Are you ready to upgrade now? Google for a video on finding the PAM upgrade software and documentation, or just go to docops.ca.com. For more detail on this product, click the information bubble in the top right corner to load the product page. From there, you can visit product documentation, support, communities, and learning paths.